City Singers started in 1995. And it was started by a lady named Helen Finch, who believed that the community had a lot to offer and went through the various churches here in town, got a little mailing list of all of us, and asked us if we would like to be in a community choir. We had a group from maybe 16 years old up to 80. So we've had a lot of different people over the years, and we've continued year after year since 95, and we're proud to be here now. I appeal to that fun sense of participation and being in a community choir and helping each other and, know, and pulling them along and, and giving them the opportunity to, to be the leader to the next person around them and uh, to do their best and help others do their best too. Anybody can join and I love every single member of this group. I accompanied for them for about 12 years. It's the ambiance that, the, that every single member exudes and the love that we feel when we can sing together and contribute to our community. What are the holidays without music? I think music is a very important part of any community and of any holiday season. We have two performances. Our first one is on December 10th, and that's at Park City Community Church at 7 p.m. And our second one is on December 16th, and that's at St. Luke's Episcopal Church, again at 7 p.m. We are doing a couple from the Messiah, so we are doing the Hallelujah Chorus and For Unto Us a Child is Born, which is a perennial annual favorite. And we do invite members of the uh, audience to come up and sing with us on the Hallelujah Chorus. So um, it's their opportunity to come up and be a part of a larger choir too. So they, that's always a fun thing. I enjoy just trying to pull the best out of everybody and they make uh, music as much as possible and make the blend that we have in the choir to be uniform across and, and it's fun. It's just fun to be with the choir and um, we joke around and yet we get the work done. So it's a, it's a fun experience. I would say 2002 was a big year because we auditioned for the uh, national anthem for the Olympics and we were chosen. So we got to be at all the Olympic events and got to sing at all of them. However, we have lost choir members along the way and we've had tribute years to different people. So those are the, the years that really stick out, but every year, holiday time, Park City wouldn't be Park City without the Park City singers. You know, in the future, if you would like to join us, we would love to have you be part of our group. We meet every Tuesday night at Park City Community Church from 7 to 9 p.m. You can get in contact with any member of the choir and we can help um, arrange for that. <laughs>